At number eight, we have the Atlanta Falcons taking Michael Penix Jr., probably the most questionable draft pick of the night, Dobbs. Probably? This is so this is what uh Falcons head coach Raheem Morris said on Michael Penix. The Green Bay model was something we talked about. It proved to be right last year. Hopefully we'll be right with them. Unfortunately, Jordan Love and Michael Penix Jr. are not the same player like at all. Um, Jordan Love came out and was kind of very raw out of Utah State and sat behind a Hall of Famer in Aaron Rodgers. Not to say Kirk Cousins isn't good, but he's not Aaron Rodgers. And Michael Penix is also 24 with two ACLs. So kind of a different situation here. And also, I feel like you're kind of competing now and the Packers were already competing and it, you know, you could have used the top eight pick on a defensive player or move down. That's where, that's where they're killing me with this one. And look, I'll say, look, Saints fans, Panthers fans and Bucks fans aren't going to be complaining about it. You know what I mean? But look, jokes aside, like you could have traded down a couple of picks and, and gotten a lot of capital that you probably need and still made this pick. It, you could have just, just you know, it does not does not made the pick at all. Taking taking Spencer Rattler in like the third or the fourth if you want to go this route. I'm not trying to be funny because the truth is, at least with Spencer, you're getting a guy younger and with the, out the injury history. And again, I I do like Penix's tape from this year, but with that said, there's also a lot of flaws in the tape. It's not like he's some you know, world beating prospect where and to that point, he's, he's 24. Like there, we got what he, by the time he starts, he's going to be 26, 27 with injury history. And I'm not sure. Look, this could end up being a, a masterclass pick where we look back on this in a few years and we say, Oh wow. The green Bay motto is just a motto. And that's just how all teams should be approaching it. But as of right now, this very moment, and a lot of Falcons fans would agree. It was one of the worst value in ter- because because you could be competing immediately like the Falcons that's why I'm saying more than anything the Falcons had a chance like they, they have they they still do but that window definitely shrunk significantly tonight when you didn't use this capital that you just had to get a potential all pro type of player in the immediate window Michael Penix will be 24 on May 8th this year yeah i i just dobs like i think what is so frustrating is you are trying to win this now. Like, if you wanted to have a bridge quarterback, why are you signing Kirk Cousins? Like, do you think, like, I understand they called Kirk before they made the pick, but do you think they were like, they talked about this possibility before they signed him? It's kind of weird, right? Like, I, I just, oh, I don't understand, absolutely. like, how you have a defensive head coach and you take a 24 year old quarterback to sit behind a guy you just paid like 160 million. I don't yeah, understand. It, you know, it, that's the truth is no matter how we try to slice it, it wasn't the best value at pick eight that no matter what, that is the bottom line. At this pick is, eight wasn't this the best. Is my value. one argument though. I don't know if Penix is making it past pick 11. Like, I know the Vikings ended up trading up to 10 to take McCarthy, but I don't know if the Vikings had Penix higher than McCarthy. I don't think so, but I also do think he is a possible pick at 12 and definitely the pick at 13. So No, absolutely, though. I think it's a tough spot where it's like, it's a bad value pick, yes, but were you going to get him later? I don't know. I think maybe 10 was the, the latest they could get him. But that's what I was you no, know, it would either have to be nine or ten. Like but with that being said though, dude, like I I I hate the pick just as much as you. I'm just trying to like provide maybe their like fucking reasoning on why they made this pick. No, no, it's it it is it's tough. It's tough. 